Welcome to Aptitude Destination. Please pause the video and read the question completely. They have given that the total number of questions in the exam is 90. So let's consider n equals 90, which is the total number of questions. Now a student has attempted all the 90 questions. Let's say c is the number of questions that he has attempted correctly which means the remaining will be incorrect responses. The remaining can be represented as n minus c, which means we are subtracting the number of correct responses from the total number of questions. Now they are saying that 5 marks are allotted for every correct answer and 2 marks are deducted for every wrong answer. So this student has got a total of 387 by attempting all the 90 questions. This can be represented as 5c where c is the number of correct responses plus n minus c where n minus c is the number of wrong responses into minus 2 because for every wrong response 2 marks are going to be deducted is equal to 387. Now since we know the value of n already that is 90 we can substitute it here and then find the number of correct responses. Solving this, we will get 5c minus 180 plus 2c equals 387, 7c equals 387 plus 180, 7c equals 567. Now c will be 81, which is the number of the correct responses. Now we know that the total is 90 questions, therefore the number of correct responses should be subtracted from 90. The incorrect responses would be 90 minus 81, that is 9. Therefore, option A is the right answer.